Okay, in this demo video, I'm going to be doing a demonstration on the grooved block shape, and this one right here, and we can see that it is six inches long by three inches wide by two inches tall. So this particular shape, I'm going to want to draw the right side view uh, right here. And I'm going to start here as my origin in this lower left corner. I'm going to travel over three inches. I'm going to go up two, one to the left, one down, one to the left, one up, one to the left, and two back down to the origin. So I have created a new document, and I'm naming it Grooved Block. Now I'm going to hit OK. So now that the workspace has shown up on my screen, the first thing I want to do is start a new sketch. And I'm going to choose the right side view for this sketch. Then I'm going to go over to my view cube over here to the right side of the screen. I'm going to choose right. So now that it looks like a flat piece of paper, I'm going to use my line tool. Starting in the origin, I'm going to click once to start. I'm going to travel to the right, three inches, enter. I'm going to go up, click once, type in two inches, enter. To the left, click one inch, enter. Down, click one inch, enter. To the left, click one inch, enter. Up. If you notice, if you line up with that point right there, it will line it up for you. You can see the uh, horizontal and vertical um, lines show up and you know you're even. So you can click there. When you head over here, you'll notice the origin light up and you know you're even with your origin. So that's one way to do it. And now that it's lit up in gray, you can tell that it's an enclosed area. So I can go over here to my camera and switch it over to isometric. And now I'm going to head over to my extrusion tool and extrude not one inch, but six inches. Hit enter, green check mark, and there is your uh, grooved block.